Welcome back. It is day 13 of my 13 for 31 series where I show you how to cut 13 Halloween inspired projects on your CNC. With this video, I am breaking all the rules. They say you're not supposed to choose a favorite child or a favorite CNC project. Well, I've got my favorite CNC project behind me in the enclosure. And Steven Jr., you know it's you.
You've got the bats in the moon here. I think the contrast is awesome between the purple and the gray. And I just left the edges up there flat. I didn't add any kind of special treatment to the edges. Come over here to the jack-o'-lantern. You've got your classic style smiling jack-o'-lantern. On this one, I actually added a profile up there just to soften the edge a little bit. Show you guys a different style, which you can do. After you design these, you can use black nails. You can use the silver nails, whichever you like. I thought the black looked perfect here with the pumpkin and the jack-o'-lantern. And then this one here, this one I guess you could consider a reverse or a negative image. On this one, I actually left the spider, the color of the wood that I stained, and then I did the actual webbing. So with this style, all you have to do is do a frame all around the outside there, and then that is your outer boundary of your spider web. And it's just a cool look. It's a completely different style than these two over here. But I absolutely love them all. I think this project turned out, I've been wanting to do some of these string art canvases for a while. So this was the perfect project. Let me know in the comments down below which one of these is your favorite. Thank you for watching and happy Halloween.